this is something that I wrote on January 22nd, 2015. I think I was watching Markiplier play scary games. Oh wait, let, let's actually back up. I woke up at 5.58 and stayed up because I had a dream that was scary, and I knew if I went back to sleep there would be another one. I'm experienced in the field of having bad dreams. I call it from a mile away when I had the Ghost 26 dream. In any case, it still gives me the shivers, so I suppose I'll record all I can remember. I think I was watching Markiplier play scary games. That's not a first, but this dream was. Suddenly, he's playing SCP Containment Breach, failing miserably at it. For no reason, I'm warped into the game without realizing it until it's too late. I'm really shivering right now. <laughs> this dream might haunt me for a while, like the... <laughs> This... I gotta say this in full without stuttering. This dream... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm ruining it, I'm ruining it, I'm ruining it. I'm ruining the effect, I'm sorry. <sighs> this dream might haunt me for a while, like that one with the camera that took a picture of the kid on the cover of Silent Hill's Shattered Memories, and then the weird grandma that's red. <laughs> oh my god, the weird grandma that's red. Oh, you're done. Quotes that you can put on t-shirts. This dream might still haunt me for a while, like that one with the camera that took a picture of the kid on the cover of Silent Hill Shattered Memories, and then the weird grandma that's red. <laughs> Shit, son. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That dream, also the one where there was a tornado whenever my dad drove the lawnmower by my window in third grade. Hey, at least I'll have something to talk about when the next 100% NASCAR 08 race comes around this summer. I forgot to do that. <laughs> it's September. Fuck. Too late for that. Anyway, back to the dream. The part that really gives me the shivers is when I say fuck this shit and hide under my blankets with my eyes closed. The second I have my eyes closed and feel around, I can feel my skin. So I know the blanket is not covering part of my body, so the thing can see me. I made the number one mistake. I closed my eyes. Not only does that fuck you vehemently in the ass in dreams, like it did with the dad not dad eats and treats pinata dream. <laughs> That's a different story. But it was me trying to escape SCP-078. So yeah, you can about imagine how it went. There was a loud scream, probably emitting from me. The entire time I had my eyes closed and my heart was racing as if I had just gotten done with sprints. I woke up with my eyes shooting open, but that was the most violent thing. I wasn't sweating and my heart was racing. I was so scared over it so I just laid there for about three minutes contemplating what had just happened, shivering violently whenever I thought about the ending before finally getting the TV remote and saying fuck this shit and I watched TV until about 6.30 when I got on my computer. I was done with everything and ready to go with, ready to go about 7.44, so I laid on my bed some more until 7.54. I finally got my car to defrost my windows so I didn't have to stand out there for an hour doing that. Stories from the past. Big ass zit on my mouth like always. And there. I really hate this one right here. Because whenever I get one of these, it doesn't go away for like six months and then it finally does go away and like only a week later it comes back and then stuck there for another six months and you're just like, uh, why even bother? So yes, thank you all so much for watching this trip down memory lane. Thank you all so much for watching. Bye.